But first tonight, catching a sleeping bandit may seem funny, but you never know what kind of mood they may wake up in. Just ask Albuquerque police. News 13's Aaron Drawhorn has the APD video of one tough arrest. I'm going to register uh, the truck is stolen. Albuquerque's auto theft epidemic became all too real for this man. Yeah, I, mean, I see it on the news all yeah. the time. His truck was stolen. Not shocking with the Duke City shifting to second worst city in the country for grand theft auto. Also not shocking, officers running plates seeing what comes back. Last month at the Aztec Apartments on Montgomery near Jefferson, that pickup was spotted. It came back hot. Inside the truck and sleeping, Robert Anthony Sanchez. The instructions were clear. I got movement. But the 25-year-old refused to cooperate. He's turning it on. If it hadn't already happened, the silence of the complex was shattered by now. Albuquerque police, turn it off! Sanchez put the stolen truck into drive and stepped on the accelerator, ramming an APD cruiser. Should have three or four flat tires. Earlier, officers sent spike belts around the stolen truck just in case, but it didn't stop him, and now the hot pursuit is on. He's driving through the entire complex. Sanchez is not going fast. Currently 10 miles an hour towards Jefferson. He can't get too far. About five miles an hour right Sanchez bolts. This car chase Where did he go? is now a foot chase. Police! He can run, but he can't hide. Sanchez is caught and cuffed and soon stuffed in the back of a cruiser, like the one he rammed. Sanchez is hauled off to a police station. He's quiet. The next day, a judge told him he wouldn't be getting out anytime soon. He's still jailed tonight. Aaron Drawhorn, KRQE, News 13. Sanchez's remained in jail because he's been violating probation. His past arrests include car theft and drugs. Now we can add aggravated battery on a police officer and more car theft charges to that list.